Hello everyone, this is Arpit Goel from Berkowitz Hair and Skin Clinics and today we will be talking about how to do a self-service at home. In case you are unable to visit a hair replacement center for your hair service, we advise you to do a self-service at home using fully taping. Let us first start with what all you will need. One bottle of C22 remover, some cotton, tape, you can use red tape or white tape in case you have a full PU border or you will have to use no shine or blue liner tape in case you are using a lace patch. A V-shaped tape, shampoo, conditioner, bowl, scissors, a white toothed comb and hair serum. We will cover the process in detail. This can be divided in three steps. Removal, cleaning and attachment. Step 1 is removal. Since the hair system is already attached to your scalp, you will need to spray C22 on the edges to take it off. We will start from the front and gently pull your hair system so it comes off slightly. Now spray C22 on the existing tape or glue to make it loose. Repeat this process till you can completely remove your hair system. Step 2 is cleaning. Now there is residual glue on your scalp and also on your hair patch. To take it off from your scalp, you use coconut oil to remove the remaining glue and then shampoo your scalp thoroughly to remove any residual glue and oil. You also might need to trim your hair in the middle in case they have grown. For cleaning your hair system, the first step is to spray C22 on some cotton and use it to wipe off any residual glue from the hair patch. Once your hair patch does not have any residual glue left, we will shampoo it thoroughly by mixing some shampoo in a bowl and dipping your hair patch in it. Make sure there is no residual glue left on your hair patch. Once you have shampooed your hair, the next step is to apply conditioner to untangle any hair. Take some conditioner in your palms and apply it on the hair patch. Use a white tooth comb to spread it evenly and wait for at least 1-2 to two minutes while keeping the patch upside down so no conditioner comes on the base of the hair patch. Wash the conditioner out and your hair patch is now ready for application. Last step is attachment. Put the hair patch backwards on a dummy to spread it out. In case you do not have a dummy at home, you can use a helmet or any round object. Use a dryer or a towel to dry the base completely. Cut the tape in 2 to 3 inch pieces and apply on the back borders. Remember to use red tape or white tape only on the PU part of the hair unit. You will have to use no shine or blue liner tape for lace hair patch. Use a V-tape for the front of the hair patch. In case you do not have a V-tape, you can cut the corners of your roll tape to match the front shape. Now peel off the liners and your patch is ready for attachment. Hold the patch with both hands and fold the hair patch like this. Now start attaching from the front and go towards the back. Once the attachment is complete, press it down with the towel like this. Now proceed to style your hair patch with a hair serum or a hair mist. I hope this video was of help to you. Thank you for watching and see you all next time.